So in this video, I have x to the power of 5 plus y to the power of 5 equals to x plus y times x to the power of 4 minus x cubed y plus x squared y squared minus x y cubed plus y to the power of 4. So if I want to prove it, I can multiply each of these terms by the bigger terms in this bracket. So I have x times x to the power 4, it will be x to the power 5, will be this one times this one will be neg negative x to the power 4y, x times this, x cubed y squared, then x times this one negative x squared y cubed, x times y to the power 4, then y times x to the power 4 minus x to the power 3y squared, plus x squared y cubed minus x y to the power of 4 plus y to the power of 5. So this one and this one cancel out. This and this cancel out. This and this cancel out. This and this cancel out. So the answer will be x to the power of 5 plus y to the power of 5. Now I can also divide it too. So I can have x to the power of 5 plus y to the power of 5 divided by x plus y y is will be x to the power of 4 will be x to the power of 5 plus y x to the power of 4 this to cancel out it will be y 5 minus y x to the power of 4 then I have minus x cubed y so when I multiply it will be negative x to the power of 4y plus or minus x cubed y squared. These two cancel out. We will be y5 plus x cubed y squared. Then if I multiply it here, it will he is gonna be x squared y squared. Multiply it, it will be x to the power of 3 y squared plus x squared y cubed is to cancel out this will be y to the power of 5 minus x squared y cubed then I will have minus x y cubed so I multiply it it will be negative x squared y cubed negative x y to the power of 4 then these two cancel out, it will be y to the power 5 plus x y to the power 4. So it means that I need to multiply by uh, add y to the power 4. When you multiply it here, it will be x y to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 times y, it will be y to the power 5. Let's cancel each other, it will be 0. So x to the power 5 plus y to the power 5 divided by x plus 5 y. It will be x to the power of 4 minus x cubed y plus x squared y squared minus x y cubed plus y to the power of 4. That will be the final answer.